Hello Pisces, welcome to your love reading. We're gonna be looking at pretty much everything you wanna know about love. Um, as always, uh, this is a general love reading, so it will not resonate with every Pisces watching, so just take what resonates for you, what applies to your situation, leave the rest. You can also check out your other placements if this doesn't resonate much for you, um, your moon, your rising sign, or any other sign of significance. I have all of the playlists for each sign linked in the description box. Um, along with the link to the extended, the extended is going to be all about your person. So this is all about the connection and then the extended will be all about your specific person. So let's jump right in for Pisces, for Pisces spirits, angels, spirits. What does Pisces need to know regarding love? What do we need to know for Pisces? What do we need to know for Pisces spirits? Or Pisces. Okay. Let's see what we get. I saw the moon a few times. Okay. So what's going on for you? What the current situation is? What can you expect? We have the Three of Cups reverse and the Knight of Swords reverse. Yikes, that's not good. I don't know what's going on with Pisces lately. It's just been difficult. Okay, any past energies or influences on what's happening here? The full reverse, temperance reverse. Okay, so just things are just not working out. Sagittarius energy with temperance reverse. How do you feel about this person? The world reverse and king of wands reverse. Yeah, you're not happy with this person. Possibly there's no closure with this person or things just haven't fully ended or begun here. Could be dealing with a uh, fire sign. Okay, what is this person, how do they feel about you or think about you? Three of Pentacles reverse. Some of you are definitely in a third party and strength Leo energy. Some of you are definitely in a third party. There's some something else happening here. Okay, um, what do you need to know? Any hidden factors? Well, we have the Five of Cups reverse, Ace of Wands reverse. Okay. So what you need to know is that something's not really happening here. There's no like new beginning or there's a delayed new beginning. And I feel it's because there's conflict that needs to be resolved with the five of cups reverse. Okay, where's all of this headed in the near future? Judgment and queen of pentacles reverse. So I feel like there's possibly um, some sort of awakening or revival maybe a second chance or someone wanting a second chance but it's interesting because i feel like someone if someone does want a second chance they don't really have a lot to gift you here with the queen of pentacles reverse what is happening okay let's look at the bottom of the deck this is kind of like why everything is happening the reason the root oh the ace of pentacles reverse so either there's been a broken commitment or a commitment that someone hasn't been able to commit, uh, some sort of loss. You know, and it's funny because I have the Ace of Pentacles reverse, the Fool reverse, the World reverse, Ace of Wands reverse. Something hasn't begun or isn't able to begin. Hmm. Pisces, what's going on? Let's get to the bottom of this. <laughs> need to know can we get some insight please spirit for Pisces what's going on here for Pisces no um oh, I was gonna say there's no cups on the board but there's a three of cups reverse we need to know for Pisces. Okay, one more. Okay, let's start with this Ace of Pentacles reverse. This is like why everything is happening. Um, the root, oh my gosh, my deck is already wanting me to talk. Okay, tell me about the Ace of Pentacles reverse. Spirit, why is the Ace of Pentacles reverse for Pisces? What's going on here? 
Ten of Wands. Yeah, this has not been easy, Pisces. Tell me about the Ace of Pentacles reverse. Why is the Ace of Pentacles reverse? So it wants to come out. Justice, Libra energy. Why justice? Why justice? Why is justice here? Oh. Queen of Cups. Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy. At least one of you wants to work things out. But for some reason I can't say both. <laughs> Not sure why. Tell me about the Ten of Wands. Why is the Ten of Wands here? I feel like there's been some sort of like, yep, I was going to say some sort of shake up. This could have been a separation, a broken commitment here. There's been a loss. Someone has experienced a loss and it's because of this Ace of Pentacles reverse. There could have been a tower that already happened. Yeah, a tower already happened. So I'm speaking to the, yep, yeah, there's a Ten of Swords. I'm speaking to Pisces viewers who have had a tower in their life possibly a separation already there's been some sort of shake up in this connection that was very negative it wasn't easy and i feel like someone it's almost like there's still things that are happening because of that that are not easy to deal with at least one of you wants to fix this but i can't say that both of you want to fix this i'm not sure why and i think it's probably because someone was deceptive here about a third party Tell me about the Three of Cups and the Knight of Swords Reverse. The world again. Can you get one more? Why is the Three of Cups Reverse? The Knight of Swords Reverse. The higher font, Taurus energy, two of pentacles. I don't want to say that there was the chariot. I don't want to say that all of you are dealing with a third party. Because the third party interference could be the fact that someone lied about something. It doesn't necessarily have to be another person involved. You know what I mean? Tell me about the Three of Cups reverse. Why is the Three of Cups reverse? Nine of Pentacles. And I feel like someone got in the way. I feel like for a lot of you, someone got in the way. Whether it was that your person or you got interested in someone else, or a third party like caused problems that you know not necessarily that they were together, but there was they caused problems. Okay, so tell me about the full reverse. The full reverse is typically someone that kind of jumps into something and it's the wrong, oh, that was a mistake. Kind of are too reckless, take too many risks. Why is the full reverse? Why is the full reverse? The lovers, okay. Why is temperance reverse? Gemini energy with the lovers. Why is temperance reverse? King of cups. <laughs> Yikes. Someone screwed up and it's a shame because I feel like there were there was genuine love here. Yeah, ace of cups, king of cups and the lovers. Someone 
someone made a mistake and it affected a connection and I think at least one of you was very like in love with this person the other person like genuinely so this is kind of a shame I mean not to well I don't want to confuse anybody so I'm just gonna leave it there <laughs> okay so let's look at the energies between you and this other person Pisces What do we need to know for Pisces spirit? What do we need to know about the energies between Pisces and this other person? Spirit, tell me about the energy that Pisces is bringing to this connection. What's the energy that Pisces is bringing to this connection? Closed off, guarded, defensive, resistant, okay. I think you've shut this person out. Yeah, burdened heart. I think you're just done. This is too much. Okay. Didn't you have a reading like that similarly? There's deep regret that wanted to come out. Okay, tell me about the person that Pisces is dealing with. Oh my gosh. Tell me about the person that Pisces is dealing with. What do we need to know about their energies? Person that Pisces is dealing with. What do we need to know? their energies moving forward movement endings cycles you're moving forward into a new chapter okay um interesting i feel like this person caused you to walk away i mean they could be moving on in their own life like making a move you know of some sort leaving something behind But I don't know. I think for a lot of you, this person caused you to shut them out. And I don't know. There's like distance now between you and this person. Tell me more about the energy Pisces is bringing to this connection. Tell me more about the energy Pisces is bringing to this connection. Thief. <laughs> I just did a reading for Cancer and this card came out as well is in the exact same spot you don't trust this person i'm going to tell you i'm going to tell you what i told cancer this person could have been deceptive that's kind of like the seven of swords deceptive or hid something from you or something like that which makes sense because the knight of swords is reverse okay tell me about the person that cancer is dealing with what are their energies person that cancer is dealing with what are their energies towards cancer towards this connection bad health <laughs> they're not doing well I think um, and it could be that they're not doing well because of you know they, they caused problems for themselves um, or they hurt you I see both you're definitely upset with the king of wands reverse Tell me about the world reverse. Tell me about the world reverse. This person could have um, lied about, yeah. This person could have deceived you about ending something in their life or beginning something in their life, whether it's with you or not. I think also it's hard for you to completely cut this out because there was a connection here that was very strong. Tell me more about the world reverse. Page of Pentacles. Okay, tell me about the King of Wands reverse. Death, Scorpio energy, and the Ten of Cups. I 
I feel like this person is going to come back in after this tower. I think they want to tell you that they want to go all the way, that they want to commit to you, that they, they're not doing well without you. Could be dealing with a Scorpio or someone with Scorpio in their chart. I don't think you're going to know what to do when this offer comes in. Knight of Cups at the bottom of the deck here and then the Hangman. Because I don't think you trust them after what's happened. Tell me about the Three of Pentacles reverse. Why is the Three of Pentacles reverse? Three of Pentacles reverse. Six of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles reverse? Excuse me, Pisces. I just had like the biggest yawn. And it's the middle of the day, so I'm not sure what's going on. But I, I'm some. I'm, I feel worn out, <laughs> exhausted. I feel like this is someone that wants to fix things. Six of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Let's have things back the way they were. You know, even though things are, you know, things are not working out right now, but I want to change that. Tell me about strength. Why is strength here? <laughs> yeah, this person is very worried, stressed, fearful. Can I get one more? The moon. There you are, Pisces. I think that there's they're worried about what they don't know, you know, about the they have fears, doubts, confusion. They need to be brave to do what they want to do, but I just don't know what's what's going on with them because towers are not little things. <laughs> towers are disruptive. They're, they're not things you can ignore. So this person, if they're really serious about fixing things or rebalancing things which i feel like they are this ace of pentacles reverse this ace of wands reverse is not good enough queen of pentacles reverse is not good enough three of pentacles reverse not good enough all of these energies here they're not great talk about the five of cups reverse and the ace of wands reverse why is the five of cups reverse here with the ace of wands reverse Yikes, the devil, Capricorn energy. Can I get one more about the ace of, not the, yeah, the ace of wands reverse and the five of cups reverse. Yep. Okay, so I'm getting someone that really wants to start things begin things, take the initiative. Um, but I feel like the devil energy here, Capricorn energy, by the way, it's almost like restricting someone. Someone's feeling tied, restricted. And so they're not doing something here with the four of swords and the five of wands. Maybe they don't want to cause drama or difficulty or arguments. Tell me more about the devil.
Why is the double here? Knight of Swords. The Knight of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So I feel like this could be an apology. And you had a reading, the last reading for you Pisces, I believe was them asking for forgiveness. So this person could be asking for forgiveness again, or they haven't done that yet. It's, this is still ongoing. I feel like there's something keeping them from doing this though. Tell me about Judgment and the Queen of Pentacles, Rivers. Tell me about Judgment, the Queen of Pentacles, Rivers. I don't know why I keep yawning. Tell me, yeah, Four of Cups, Four of Swords. This is somebody that's not doing something. Like they're they're just sitting around instead of actually doing something. What's this? Queen of Swords. Maybe they're scared to approach you, Pisces. Maybe you're hard to approach because you're closed off. Maybe it's not easy to offer you a cup or you're not open to an opportunity with this person again. I think this person is afraid of being rejected, afraid that it's completely over. I almost get like they don't want you to move on. But if they want to be successful, this 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 isn't it right here. Like this is not good. Can I get one more for judgment? What can you tell me about judgment? Knight of Pentacles, yeah. I feel like this is somebody that's going to want to make you an offer. An offer to, to really start things again, to have this world. But I don't think that this offer is enough. I have the Five of Swords here, Eight of Swords, and the Five of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. So I almost feel like there's something missing here with this offer. It looks great, but upon closer inspection... <laughs> There's just something that's not really right. It's almost like this could be somebody that wants to, like maybe this is a, a half-hearted apology or it's an apology but not the apology you feel you deserve or this is an offer but not the offer you feel you deserve. Like maybe the apology or the offer does not make up for the fact that this tower was horrible. You know what I mean? And it's funny because I feel like someone really wants to have this new beginning, but you have the world reverse. So I'm, I don't know. It's almost like there's no closure with what happened. So maybe this person, you know, this page of pentacles is not enough. This knight of pentacles is not enough. I think you need like an ace of pentacles or something like big like that. You know, ace of wands, ace of swords, something to really start things off on the right foot. I think a lot of you don't trust this person, so you've kept your distance, you've closed yourself off from this person. And that just makes it harder for them because I feel like you're showing up as a queen of swords energy. And um, some of you might outright reject this person because it's just not a good enough offer. Can I get one more for this queen of pentacles reverse? One more please for this Queen of Pentacles reverse. Page of Wands. This is like, I don't know, pages, knights, I, I don't know. Four of Pentacles is at the bottom of the deck. I just like, I get this energy of you not being impressed. You're not impressed. You're not happy to hear from. It's almost like you may be in, in your mind. 
talking things out with this person would go a certain way but the reality when it does happen is very different and i feel like you just end up even being more disappointed when it's all said and done despite the fact that i think there was a lot of i don't know maybe you feel this is a this is your soulmate maybe there was like um a real strong connection here real love but I don't know, I'm picturing a crumpled up piece of paper that someone's like trying to uncrumple. Like maybe to you, this was a something so great that was ruined in such a way that there is no going back. Or if you were to go back and start over, it would be with a wrinkled piece of paper. So the magic is kind of lost, you know? That's kind of the energy that I, I pick up from here. but. What I don't really get very strongly is your person's energy because I feel like they're kind of lost. I know that they want to um, make you this offer with this Knight of Pentacles, but I also feel like they're, they're so fearful and so anxious and so like confused that um, I'm trying to figure out if this is fear because they care about you so much and they don't want to lose you or fear for selfish reasons, right? Like, you know, maybe they don't want to lose you, but it's not for the best intentions. I'm trying to give them the benefit of the doubt because the Six of Pentacles is here with the Four of Wands. So I feel like this is someone that really wants to bring back stability and give you something, right? Equal give and take. If some of you are dealing with a third party and, and that third party is another person that this your person was involved with they need to leave that person and i feel like you're not even going to talk to this this individual until that's done you don't want to hear from them un until they're absolutely done with that other situation so that might take some time because i feel like part of the reason you know, if you are dealing with a third party and your person is with that part, that other third party or, um, still, it's because of fear. It's almost like this person can't be alone. Or they think, I don't want to lose both, right? So if I leave my current person and I go after Pisces and Pisces rejects me, now I don't have anybody. Otherwise, I'll leave it here. Pisces, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy the reading. Um, if you did enjoy it, hit that like button and subscribe so you can see more readings from me. And I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.